The state is taking its job fairs to a larger audience. First up, home of the Upper Valley Nighthawks. Local 22's Dana Casulo has more on the first at bat of the Triple Play Job Fest. The Vermont Labor Department and the State Workforce Development Board are working with the state's three collegiate baseball teams to host a triple play job fest. We have over um, or close to 20,000 unfilled jobs in Vermont. Local employers will be set up during the Upper Valley Nighthawks game Friday night to promote openings to local job seekers and fans. The employers represent a, a diverse uh, set of industries. We have uh, manufacturing represented, we have healthcare. Nolato GW, a medical device company and a facility in Bethel and Royalton, is looking to hire. Well, I'm sure as you know, many employers now are struggling to find workers. So anything that we can do um, to, you know, go through community engagement and just try new things to, to meet people. The company has about 35 positions it's looking to fill between both facilities. We have entry level positions. It's manufacturing, so you have to be 18, but other, otherwise come on board, we can train you. Patty Hanchett is a human resources generalist and recruiter at Springfield Hospital. She says a current struggle is getting people that want to work in person. Another part of the harder part is now everyone wants remote work. Well, we don't have a lot of remote positions, if any. So we want someone that wants to be here every day, wants to help people, because every single job we have basically helps a patient. Also in attendance, VTRANS, Vermont Department of Corrections, Dartmouth Hitchcock Medical Center, Vermont Packing House, and Job Corps. Additional job fairs are set for July 27th in Montpelier and in Burlington July 28th. Dana Casulo, Focal 22 News.